Hey guys, it is Sunday and we are headed to New Orleans for Mardi Gras. Woo! Nolens. <laughs> um, we got up a little late because we were supposed to head out like 8, 9-ish and it's 10, 10, 10.46. Um, we got in really late last night from work so we worked up until I think it was like 1 o'clock in the morning. But we got everything packed, we got all of our stuff, we got pillows and blankets and a cooler full of beer and our liquor and clothes and oh, we're just so ready we're ready to go so <laughs> we're so excited we we're supposed to have a couple come with us a friend of ours but last minute they backed out so boo anybody, anybody, on you anybody wants to meet us over there we got a two-bedroom yeah we rented a two-bedroom condo about a mile and a half from bourbon street and our friends were like well, we can't go so stinkers um, but yeah, we are on our way. We just left about 10 minutes ago, and I will keep you guys posted. I'm gonna go eat something right now. Bye. There she is. Hey guys, so we are on the bridge going to New Orleans. We are about 20 minutes out. This bridge terrifies me. That's why I'm not driving. Are you ready? Oh my gosh, we're so ready. Um, the sun is like beaming in my face. We're here, we're safe, we made it. We're gonna check into our house rental and, uh, oh, our house rental and then we're gonna change. I'm gonna put slap some makeup on, probably have a couple drinks and head out to see what Bourbon, Street's, Bourbon Street brings to us. See you guys later. Hey guys, so we're here in New Orleans. We are making our way to the place we're staying at. Everybody's just in the spirit. I see slight decoration and, and colors, and a lot of the houses are decorated for Mardi Gras. It's just awesome. Awesome over here. So, making our way to the home for the next arrive at your destination. four or five days. I think we're gonna probably go to Biloxi afterwards. Hey guys, so we're at the house. It's the house right behind me. It is gorgeous. We got the bottom, it's like the bottom apartment. This owner lives up top. He's a lawyer and he lives in a gorgeous neighborhood. We're right here by the river. The river, let's see, you see it right there? And it's just beautiful. Like I'm just, this neighborhood is gorgeous. I'm so excited. It's about a mile and a half to two miles to the French Quarters, Bourbon Street and all that stuff. So we're going to just leave the car parked here. We're going to be making our way either on bus or Uber or something. But we're going to, and I'm going to show you guys inside in a minute. So give me a second and I'll show you guys inside, okay? All right, guys. So we are in the house. It's actually like the apartment downstairs, but it is gorgeous. So let me show you guys everything. Um, it didn't cost it. We actually got here. We're supposed to check in a little, well, not check in, but arrive a little bit earlier. It was, I think it was like eleven or $1,200. Um... For those of you who are interested, I know some people are like, oh my gosh, I can't believe she said how much it costs. But I mean, I'm going to be honest with you guys. So there's a porch. It has a screen around it. so nice. Um, it's got a swing bench. And he says he's got a big dog on the other side. So, but I don't know. Um, so this is the living room area. Okay. It's got a couch. It's got two chairs. The TV. Yeah. And there's internet, Wi-Fi, all the channel, like local channels, and then there's like all the other stuff, like HBO and stuff. Bookshelf, I don't even know. Like, can we go over here? Oh, it goes straight to the laundry room. Okay, cool. I was gonna go all the way around. I was not sure. So this is the laundry room. I'll show you the rest of the house. This laundry room is huge. This is like momhood laundry's dream. It's huge. Got linens and stuff. Got another door from the outside, stays locked all the time. Then we got the next bedroom. <laughs> My husband's recording too. It's just a little, the secondary bedroom is little, got a, I think it's like a queen. And then, let's see what's next. 
I want you, I was like, I was gonna do it front facing, but I was, okay, so here's the master. You walk in, king size bed, got a blanket over there, some cute lamps, really cute little desk, little side tables, they're so cute. This house is gorgeous, by the way. I mean, it's obviously a really old house, but it is so pretty. And this is the end of the hallway, and then we have the restroom, and two linen closets, and then we have the shower, toilet, and everything else. But I just want to share with you guys because this house, looks, I was really nervous about like where we're going to stay because I knew it was like a, I, I kept saying condo. My husband was like, why are you saying condo? It's not a condo. It's a, a house split in two. Like, I was like, okay. But the guy came down and he's so nice. He's a musician as well. He's also a lawyer. He said he's been partying like two days in a row. So he's hanging out upstairs. He's like, it's done. I need to rest. <laughs> so we're here. Oh, let me show you the kitchen next kitchen's got everything stove and he hooked it up I mean he put there's like beers in here and they have there's like a, like basics uh, stove microwave the kitchen is so pretty and then he has coffee maker blender toaster good deal man and you get wash and dryer that's so awesome and then a little oh, hey. dining room or what um and then yeah kitchen dining room but yeah, that's it, guys. Uh, we're going to change. I'm going to put some makeup on, and we're going to head out. See you guys later. Mardi Gras outfit, day one, night one. Sheer shirts. It's got a bra underneath. Shorts from Torrid. And some sandals. We'll see how I do with the sandals. Yes, the bellies. You can see the belly, but that's okay. It's Mardi Gras. I will see you guys in a little bit. Hey, guys. Just real quick. We are... Let me see if I can get my face in here. <laughs> We are headed out. We are ready to go. I um, just want to let you know that we're headed out. I know a lot of people were concerned that we were going to be like Mardi Gras. And it's like, oh, you guys be safe. And I'm like, yes, 100% safe. We're going to be good. Um, we're fortunate enough to be staying in a really, really nice neighborhood. I mean, this neighborhood that we're staying in the area is just absolutely gorgeous. And it's beautiful and kept up. And it's just, I'm, I'm so excited. I'm so excited to see everything um, that... I don't know I'm just excited to see everything in the history because I know tomorrow I want to go my husband and I watched the show on HBO Treme I think that's how you pronounce it and we want to go to the Treme uh, to Treme and just see different areas and uh, explore and go eat some good food I want some crawfish so bad so I will talk to you guys later we're gonna walk up the road see if we can catch a bus to the uh, French headquarters so see you guys later bye hey guys um, we just came up the road from the house that we are staying at it's like a like the center, like the town. Um, there's like lights, restaurants. There's a cafe. It's so beautiful over here. The houses are absolutely gorgeous. And we're just waiting. We're gonna um, couldn't figure out the bus schedule, so we are gonna get an Uber to come pick us up, and then we're gonna head to the French quarters. Um, anybody who has any questions or wants information on where we're staying in like the area, let me know, and I'll let you guys know. I'll like email you back or. Um, give you guys the information on that because I know um, staying on Bourbon Street I have a couple friends that are staying at Crown Plaza but it's really expensive so but over here it's gorgeous and you can actually within I think like the town or the neighborhood over here like the area you can walk with beer in a can or bottle and glass and no problem but once you get to like a public area because this is all private over here it has to be in a cup so that's how that is yeah, we are so excited. See you guys later. We have officially arrived. Woo! Uh, so excited, guys. We're here. I'm going to go get a drink, get our drink on, and just have a good time. Woo! I got beads already. More beads. Oh my gosh, you got women in here painting boobies up there. So crazy. There's women in there painting their breasts. We're having so much fun and we haven't even been here five minutes. We'll see you guys later.
been a bad girl, but I'm having fun. The street is packed with people. And then we have our law enforcement to the right, right, but we're not allowed to videotape them. So I'm safe and I'm having fun. So that's the most important thing. I will see you guys later. are headed back to our home for the next four days we look at this I've been a bad girl <laughs> I had so much fun we are heading back to the house that we're staying at and we had so much fun music and alcohol <laughs> and people and just so much love and I love it it's so much awesome he tried to help me out with some beads. I don't know how I'm gonna take these off, but we'll see. I will see you guys later. Ya todo es...